me the pistachios! Just jam Ordinarily, I don't put two My Team videos in one. And ordinarily, I don't have little intros to my videos either, but I'm gonna try and make it how I made it about three, four months ago with 2K13. Gonna include a little snippet of the game to come before every video to show you a little highlight that might entice you to watch the game. This is this is game six, and as you can see, the lag is ridiculous. Um, the game was unplayable. Obviously, he ended up he ended up waiting for opponent. Now, when this happens, does this mean he disconnects, or did I time out? Was it my internet or his internet? And then it tells me 2K Sports Server wasn't available. I was mad. I was doing this game live. The recording didn't work out, but I get the loss. I get the loss here. That doesn't make sense. If the 2K servers are unavailable, whatever bullshit. Why? Why do I get the loss? Does that mean he gets the win? Anyway, right? I mean, tell me what you think. And if that's ever happened to you before, right now we're going into game seven. In the, this eighth seed, I'm trying to get to the seventh seed. Let's get into this thing. You know, I've been playing a lot of great teams lately, and this guy has an all bronze lineup. Well, he had an all bronze bench, pretty average team, which is uh, really a great surprise because I need to get some easy wins out here. And it wasn't. It was not an easy win. Oh, shit. Scotty Pippen putting the ball back with a goddamn win. I had to show him replay in reverse and slow motion. Now this is the type of bullshit that's been happening to me quite a lot. Well, people have been trying to do it. George Charges in the back court. George Charges even in the front court, and it's ridiculous. Why? Please don't do it. Like if you're a person who does it, you can admit it. You can say it. But you're just a terrible person for it. It just a why? It doesn't make sense. It's so cheap. Anyway, I try and get a two for one. I don't know what. Right here, and you're saying two for one. That doesn't make sense. Less than 24 seconds. Oh, see, it makes sense right now. And I beat the buzzer beater shot clock just in time. CP on a nice steal. And I tie the game up into this third quarter right now. These games go by fast when you commentate them and you don't put in the whole game. But finally, I get the lead. And you know, Scotty Pippen's a beast. Oh, I actually got him twice in the pack openings. And he draws another charge right there. I was raging hard. It was, it was, it was stupid because the game was real close. Like if the game is tied, I don't even care. I mean tied. If the game is um, big difference, I don't even care. You know. But you know that made me mad. But I try and do whatever I can to get the win the fair way. And see, I keep doing hop steps. If you watch my my career as well, I got a problem with hop steps. I just keep doing them instead of regular dunks or layups. Tim Hardaway's a beast from three. He's my sixth man, and he can hit. He can knock three like no tomorrow. I get I get out to a little lead right now. Javale McGee gets the nice post move. I don't really know any post moves. I tried to go into the training camp, whatever, and learn some. But a CP hits Scotty Pop, Scotty Pippen on, on a very nice cut. That's the type of things I like to see. That is realistic basketball. And I'm gonna say anything. I got nothing to say. It's disgusting. Scotty Pippen's on fire as he gets the facial dunk. It's just ew. What a way to finish a game. Seven point win. I'm out. Prince out. Go, Scotty Pippen. And one! Get back in it! Nice move right here, but way to finish on the other side of the rim to avoid the shot blockers. Oh okay, yo, yo, yo! Nice pass! Warning, Let's go! Warning, warning, he didn't hit me for the three, but once I made that cut, it was over. Let's go. I'm running. It's a one on three, or two on three. I'm taking it to the rim right now. Easy layup. Oh, not the... Oh, oh they're 